Hello everybody. Today I'm going to show you my new pattern, which I called August Socks. And yes, we're going to use block the sock blockers to show it to you. But first, maybe to show you the lace. <laughs> So here are the toe-up socks, fingering weight yarn. There are four sizes. So we have 48, 56, 64, and 72 stitches. So you can play with the yarn weight. For instance, 48 for me would be the DK weight yarn with, maybe I would use 2.75 millimeters. So I think it's size two US. Um, and um, I have it published already, so a few people have bought it. Thank you so much for supporting. And one person said that, oh, that's that's not cables. Yes, that, that's not a cable. So when you see the chart, you will see it's quite simple. I love simple things. Not really a fan of uh, cables per se, of the process of knitting them. You know, it's a slower knitting, to be honest, because you have to, yeah, you have to twist the stitches. So um, I prefer lace. So this is a lace. I know it may look like cables, but there are not. I love something that it's rhythmical, that you have an idea how to do it. So we have after, true afterthought heel over here. Obviously, you can modify it and put any heel you want. I use US size 1, 2.25 millimeter knitting needle. And like when I'm knitting, because actually I'm showing you one sock because I'm still knitting the second one. So where I know where to put the heel, for instance, I'm just counting. And with this pattern, I like to count this. I like to count of this um, texture and I'll know how many to put it in. So for instance, that they're mirrored. So basically one side and then you repeat the other side. Although on the chart, you have a full thing. The charts are on the last two pages. So maybe you read the pattern first, you'll see what you need to print. And maybe that way you will you will know how to do, especially if you've knitted my patterns before. Uh, there are coupon code down below, 20% off. However, you can get three for two. Any of my patterns, if you put three into the cart on Reverly, um, the cheapest one will be for free. Should show up before you actually press buy. What else? I knew I had a few things. So normally I like tubular bind up, but with this one I have um, ribbing that comes out of the pattern. So I just did a standard, I would call it. It is written down. Uh, what else I can tell you? So rhythmical. So if you give you a tip, so over here when you make yarn overs, there are certain rounds you need to do. So always first one check how, how much kind of those stitches coming out from that yarn over for you to initiate like the the pattern <laughs> something that you need to do uh, that way i kind of keep a track that i'm not adding extra round or i have less rounds with the um, other texture over here um i was either not giving away the pattern i was even thinking three or two and that's kind of repeats either or on one side on the other side i'm not talking about i'm just talking about texture hopefully that makes sense for you obviously we have yarn over so be equal here and there and that's kind of gives me an idea too when i stop because with the little one you stop a lot <laughs> yeah that's it if you have any questions please leave uh, comments down below and I hope you enjoy this one. I have um, socks on Reverly, but this is kind of a series from, I started in March, I think, and we're going to finish in February. That's that. I hope you enjoy this one. See you next one. Bye.